In this video, we are going to talk about the threshold tool in PS Touch. Hello guys, welcome back to this tutorial. Unlike the Ray Photoshop where we have the Blendif tool, we can easily use it to collect clouds, do so many fun things with it. But well, in PS Touch, there's an alternative way to the blend if that is what we call the threshold tool. So take a look at this image, assuming we want to extract the sky from it. It can be easily be done using the blend if tool. But since we don't have the blend if tool here in PS Touch, we can use threshold. So to, to do that, click right here then click on stylize you will see threshold so right now we have everything in black and white but before we do this let's go back before we do this let's click right here and duplicate this layer so we duplicate it done so now let's go back to the threshold so click right here then threshold so as you can see we have everything in black and white and this is where the fun begins so as you can see we have the threshold here you can increase it reduce it we also have smoothness you can increase the smoothness like so as you can see we are seeing the clouds so let's just increase it a bit let's work on the threshold okay now we can't reduce we can remove this four color which is black we don't want the black we only want the white so let us go to the black reduce it click on done and as you can see let me use let me create a colored a solid color layer so you can see it clearly let me use red so as you can see, we have this in its own layer. So another fun thing, maybe there is some to keep the effect of this one. What you can do is to click on this layer, click right here, click on select pieces. You can turn this one off, then click on this original one. You click right here and then layer from selection. So this is the original one we got from the main layer itself. So now this is how you select bright colors. Now how do you select dark colors? Now let's take a look at this other example. Okay, here we have these images right here. And let's assume we want to select only the dark colors of this cloud. So to do that, like we did in the previous step we click right here and duplicate this layer duplicate click on done then we can come over here to fx then threshold so this time we're not going to use white so let's take the black back up the white we're going to reduce it to zero and as we did before we play with the threshold okay to your own taste we can play with the smoothness as well okay once you are done you click on done but as you can see this one is black we don't want black we want the exact color from this cloud so to get that exact color click on this layer we have we just gotten then click right here click on select pieces from there you can click right here turn it back off click on this bottom layer you can click right here and then layer from selection so done when you turn off this layer as you can see we have this layer as you can see we now have the dark part on its own layer so that's the threshold there are many more stuff the Treasure tool can do. I have a lot of videos on this channel. You can find a lot of them. So thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye bye.